So this is uh, the King of the Road Auto Parts um, junkyard in An uh, Holland, Ohio, on, on Angola Road. On, I'm, I'm gonna try to post this video sometime today, hopefully, um, because on Monday here they are scrapping, or gonna start scrapping all of these cars. We have a. Uh, Subaru XT here, blue one. Renault Fuego Turbo. Look at those seats. Car cool. Renault Fuego Dutch. <laughs> I finally touched the Renault Fuego. You... <laughs> Your life's complete. It is. One of the most, like, my favorite underrated cars. Well, it's not even underrated. It's just... Oh, no. No no notorious, seen. maybe? This is a GDL. It's a higher level. Wow. That's the second. This is the second Yuga. There's one behind the Renault. That's not something you should say in America. Oh yeah, the Yugo behind the Renault. Right. <laughs> I think I see another one, but I think it's a Dodge Colt. But there's... Oh. there's a, is that other one a, a one as well? Or? Yeah, that beige one is a Yugo as well. How's it looking there? Ooh. Got some cans that are still canned. <laughs> I don't know if I eat for a moment, but... These wheels are so small. I think they're 12. 115, uh, 155 R13. 78 ply. Jeez. Well, that's a sharp exhaust. Ow. Yeah, please be careful when you go through here. Nothing's regulated. Probably why it's closing. Is there? Behind the Mitsubishi Colt, there is. Huh. This blue one's a Colt, right? Yeah, the blue car in front is a Colt. Okay. Yeah, another Yugo. So that's three Yugos. Oh, that that's deep. I'm gonna go over here. Ah, dry land. <laughs> Dude, yes. Hey, remember when me and my friends beat one of these with a slow camera? Yes, I do remember that. Gosh dang it. Hey, that's got an actual Yugo badge on it too. I think that's just the background. Oh. Look, it's they take too much from the European license plate holder pretty cool. Oh, it's still got the center map. Damn. So that's that's the third you go within like just one one uh, row <laughs> of cars. I think this is the most you goes in like one confined area. Oh yeah. And then a Volvo P1800 wagon. Oh yeah. Look at that. I wish I knew more about these uh cars but I'm GM guy so <laughs> I'm the I think there's another one Chevy Nova uh what year would you say this is uh 83 through 87 I know it ends in 87 okay it's a hatchback five door which is the rare one that no of course no one won, but and <laughs> note the prism hatchback five door on the bottom that's one gen difference huh Look at all these Eldorados, man. Oof, it's just North Star after North Star blown. <laughs> they all blew up. Can't say I'm sad about it either. Right. Uh, yeah. Man. Chrysler. 
Is this a Reliant or what would it be? Alec? Yeah, it says Alliant. I'm going to assume Alliant. it means Reliant. Sweet, it's got wood paneling. Mm. Mm. We're in the Chrysler section now. Not too much. A lot of K cars and stuff, which is really cool. We'll go to the GM section next. And less support for these cars than there's a Tornado. Mm, they made these until 2010. Wait, what? Really? In Yugoslavia, you could buy one of these brand new off a of showroom floor in 2010. So could you like import parts or something? Yeah. You can, I damaged a hood on mine, $11 plus shipping for a new hood. What? No way. <laughs> yeah. There's a spare tire. It's in the back now. Oh, they relocated it. It's probably like getting really hot in there, I imagine. I can't believe how clean that interior is. They poked a hole in the roof. And they just filled in with Mondo. Perfect. <laughs> how fast did it turn? It, it wasn't very good. It took me a while to get that crank back up, just in case if anyone needs to use Yugo parts. This is in the King of the Road Auto Parts in uh, in, in uh, Holland, Ohio, for uh, Angola Road. If you want to check them out, just search them up on Google. So, there's that. This part was, like, made for you. There's a furry sticker on the back. I'm is pretty there? sure... Either that or like a dog watch thing or something. Oh no. <laughs> His car's made for you. 